But take us to that first time you realized you had a story. And I know each of you talk about that a little bit differently. But what was it like, okay, I have a story. I'm not going to hoard it. I'm going to put it out there. And to do it in a confident way, how did you How did you realize you had a story? When we talk about how we became what our story is at a coffee shop, I think it's our everyday life, our everyday stories that it comes from. For me, it was an interaction with a guy at a coffee shop. Mm -hmm. The title of the book is called Are You an Elliot? How to Maximize Your Full Potential. One thing that I've learned when I've been writing for as long as I have is, is key. I've written all kinds of stories, sad stories, happy stories, plays, poems, all kinds of stuff. But when I realized what my purpose was, mm -hmm. and I think when you talk about writing a book with value and writing it at the right season and knowing when to release it, right. you got to know what your purpose in life is. And that will lead you to what you're passionate about. It will help amplify that. And once it's amplified, you want to get it out. You want to talk about it. You want to write about it. You want to sing about it. You want to do everything, market, branding, all that would just come up in you. So my book, Are You an Elliot? Seven Ways to Maximize Your Full Potential, talks about how a little uh, a, a guy is doing something because he failed at previous attempts to what he was passionate about, mm -hmm. and how we all are Elliots, and how we do sometimes become complacent and we stick to what we do every day because we have failed at what we want to do right. or we can't do what we want to do. So that is where my passion and where my writing came from and why I'm releasing this book. E-form for me is I'm not like a, um, I do have, I want printed copies of course because you do have to have a tangible product, but it was more important to me to get it out to people yeah. and I honestly wanted to do it for free. I'm like, y'all want it for free? So I said, no! I can maybe implement in your ticket price. Oh, it's yeah. a way of oh, yeah. marketing it. You're yeah, saying right. you yeah. now with your ticket, you have a free download of my book for you know, because I don't know how much it costs. So it's bigger than just knowing and having a story. Like she said, have value, have a purpose for it. Have a real purpose for it, and people will run you down. I have people, like she said, that pre-ordered it already. Mm -hmm. I wrote this two years ago, mm -hmm. you know, and it's just, it's just waiting. It's just waiting, like Chandre and Dr. Um Walmart said. I like doing that right now. <laughs> it's just waiting to be released. And I feel like I'm about to burst in the flame. I'm so excited about yes. it. And that's the passion yes. that you know yeah. you're writing about something that you truly care about. Mm -hmm. So you feel like you're about to burst in the flames mm -hmm. because you're writing it. 